Andrew, what are you doing? I think the campaign's going great, Alex. <laughs> what campaign? The posters, don't you see? I might actually win class president. That's that's good for you, Andrew. I hey, thank you. class, I have a very important announcement. Our vocabulary test is this Thursday. Hey, Mr. Nelson, aren't you forgetting something? Oh my gosh, you're right, Andrew. To help you prepare for the vocabulary test next Thursday, your homework tonight is to make flashcards. Thank you, Andrew. Mr. Nelson, what about the results of the election? Did I win? Why, yes, you actually did. Congratulations. That's great news! This is the best day of my life! How close was the race? You see, that's the thing, Andrew. Nobody ran against you. You won by default. That's crazy! Why wouldn't you want to run for class president? Being class president means you basically rule the school, am I right? Yeah, whatever you say, Andrew. What about a vice president? Have you picked one yet? Alex can be my vice president. I feel so powerful, Alex. Just think of all the good we can do. Uh, I'm not so sure. I have to start my victory tour at once. People want to meet me, their new president. Actually, I don't think anyone really cares. Look, here comes a student now. Oh, God, that hurts so much. Ow. You good, Andrew? Uh, what is this contraption? A vending machine? When did this get here? It's literally been here for like the past five years. Well, I don't care how long it's been there. For my first year as president, I'm getting rid of all the vending machines around school. Andrew, that's crazy talk. That's not crazy talk, Alex. And by the way, it's Mr. President to you. Andrew, you look ridiculous. What are you doing? I once heard that in order to get things done, you gotta look sharp. Albert Einstein. So, I intend to get things done around here. Where'd you even hear that? You know what? Never mind. Death to all vending machines. Woo! <laughs> I just don't get it, Alex. How could they not be on board with me? Well, Andrew, it's just... What did I say about calling me Andrew? Sorry, Mr. President. Yes, it's Mr. President to you. It's just students around here love that. How? Oh, might as well murder me with a knife. You super didn't. You ran into it. No, I didn't. Now, despite our arguments in this conversation, I need you to hear me. Every good president needs a good VP, and I need you on board with me. Because I'm staying here and here now, and this time, 12 o'clock on this date, which I forgot because I didn't look at my calendar this morning. I am going to bring down vending machines, whether with your help or not. Hey, Mr. Principal. Uh, you can have a seat wherever. Uh, I'm already sitting. <laughs> Mr. Campbell, what are you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I'm doing my duties as president. Your duties as president is to run the student body, not to be a vending machine vigilante. But they're evil! The vending machines are here to supply food for the students. Listen, principal, if you don't like my policies, why am I even president? Should I just leave? You know what? You should. You're stripped of your position as president of the student body. You're fired. It's been an honor to serve you all.
Dude, after that test, I need a snack. Same. Math always makes me hungry for some reason. Dude, where's all the food? Maybe it was the vending machine man. Who? You know, that, that guy that's been messing with the vending machines? Wait, I don't have no idea where you're talking about. Let's just go to 7-Eleven. This isn't even worth it anymore. This is